Should we go for the big, big bad boy, Supreme? Let's go, guys. Okay, hey guys, welcome back to another video. We just done another tier video. It'll be linked in the description for rappers in 2019. It was quite good. It got quite heated as well. Uh, so today we are doing the tier list on 2019 of designer clothing, and we're gonna designer clothing. We're gonna do it from today, like 2019, yeah. how it is currently, not in general. We got S tier, which is the best. I don't know what S, maybe superior, surprise sandwiches. <laughs> Another S word, so I don't know. And then the last one is I don't know what it is. Actually, no, that's not. That's just we don't know what it is. And F which should be the worst, worst one. We have a list of a bunch of brands here, from hype beast brands to exquisite, you know, unique brands to probably brands you've never heard of before. So we're gonna go straight into this. Should we go for the big, big bad boy, Supreme? It's got to go in S. It's got to go in S. I'm sorry, like. I'm on about, do you know why? Because there's two things about it. It's how it looks. Like there's some, mm -hmm. Okay, some of them are quite dodgy, but a lot of them are good. The yeah, impact it's had. Yeah. And then I think about the culture on like Odd Future and stuff. They've had a big culture in hip. A lot of people in hip hop you see now wear Supreme box logos. I can't, like, I just realised like, we're doing, a, we're doing a, like a clothing video and I'm wearing a Leeds United top <laughs> after we've just would... lost at the last hurdle. <laughs> uh, we've got Adidas next. It's, it's going to be tough. I'd, cause, Good but would you, because would you put. It's about culture as well, because imagine like Adidas works with everything, like TV commercials. In terms of product, because that is affordable, yeah, I'd probably put it in S then. Yeah. Nike, we're gonna have to yeah. put it in the same same one, we have to. Uh, but I fit I doubt there'll be very many ones that'll be S in like superior. Yeah. Uh let's go for golf. So is that Ooh. so that's uh, Tyler's one, right? Yeah. So I'll these are quite high beastie ones at the moment. I would I'd put that in it, it's not it's not that it's not that like what? I don't know. Not, they don't, they don't, they don't make loads of stuff like all the time though, do they? Yeah, that's that's why I'm saying that Supreme, like they're consistent with it. Should we put them at C? No, I think B. B. Because we'll they have B. had some really good like, stuff. Like the designs are nice. Tommy Hilfiger. I, uh, a big up my Tommy Hilfiger jacket. Here's a picture. Oh, but then again, have you heard, have you heard the, the Tommy Hilfiger is racist? Did you know that? How? I only figured that out. Well, as soon as I bought that uh, Tom Hilfiger uh, jacket, my dad was like, why did you buy it? Did you realise they're racist? What, <laughs> apparently, they're racist? Apparently he made some statement like uh, before, Tom, like, oh, Tommy Hilfiger, the actual guy that made yeah. it, saying something about like black people or something. Apparently he's racist. So for let's, that... Let's go and research that. Tommy Hilfiger, like, we, haven't, we haven't got like uh, any information, but just going off the brand, yeah? Mm. Like, rather than accusations and so on. Where, where are we going to put that? I'd... Like, it has to be A, surely? No? Yeah. Or B? I reckon B. Oh, we'll put a B because I do understand that. It's it's not, they haven't had the impact as, let's say, Nike or anything that's had at the moment. Bape, another Hypebeast brand here. We're going, with, yeah. we're going strong with the Hypebeast brands. Uh, where are we going to put them? Because Bape are like, I feel like everything they make is good and it's all, mm. but the only thing I. But they are quite similar. Yeah, they're all camo stuff. They're all camo sort yeah. of stuff. So for that reason, I don't know. Do you reckon we could put the the first C? But then they are. There's some of the stuff is better than Tommy Hilfiger. Yeah. We'll put that B for now. Be Let me know in the comments down below what you put for most of these things. Uh, we got Dickies. I've never ever wore Dickies top. I think I've wanted to, but it's more skateboardy. If I'm if I'm correct, getting that vibe. You know what I mean? Skateboard. Mm. So, but I do like the designs. They're all right. I put them in C. Yeah, because see. they're just oh. they're average Kenzo. <clears throat> uh, we're going for a more like posh white boy boy um, outfit here brand. Uh, I, I, where's it, where's it gone? gone? But where'd it go then? Oh, it's there. It literally look how it's like invisible. You can't even see it. I put it in C. No, I won't even see it. I don't. Yeah, really? actually, yeah, see. Oh yeah, because actually, if you think about it, like I, you know that I personally think yeah, and I, I would actually love it. I would want to get Kenzo top, but the way you know the way they're made, yeah, it's so like I feel Har Harrison's one and someone else's that my mates have. It's like it's so like hard the material. Mm. I, I just don't understand it. Like it's just very. It just says Kenzo. It's so a many, waste of money. Too many people have like jumping on. Yeah, just ruining really Gucci. But like what we okay, I'd say only for this. Take away the accusation, not the accusation, the whole thing of being a racist, should mm. we or not? Just as a brand, they make fire stuff, but they also make ugly stuff. Like you see some of their like trainers and shit. Yeah. Like ugly as hell. Like get away from me. I, I'll probably have to see. Alright. See now, nah, they have to be here. Because you can't put the same level as like Dickies, surely. Oh yeah, actually. Like, come on. I thought we might need to put this down, you know. Dickies. 
Like, if we were there, it's like, do you know what? Eh, no, nah, we'll put them at nah, D. D. That's right. D. Like, the D. Anything here is as, again, a lot of these brands, like, okay, Palace. Palace. That would be B as well. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll agree with that. Uh, last one, so I think that Supreme will be the only yeah. hypebeast brand in this video. Mm. Uh, I don't know, let me know in the comments down below. That'll be top because they, they're, they're game changers. What Stone can Island. In, what can go in A? Ooh, Ooh. A. Ooh, I, think Louis, I think Louis Vuitton could go in A, you know. Ooh, Louis, yeah? LV? Oh, wait, hang on. Versace, Versace. Let's go, surely. A. That is A class. Because I'd say, personally, but if you put that in A, then people say, oh, why are you not putting Gucci in, in A? But yeah, but Versace and okay, I'll, I'll say Versace and Gucci. Are. Yeah, I'll say Versace. Yeah, yeah, Versace are like premium, premium. And Gucci are people that are broke, but like, mm. they, they, they get the 9 to 5 job just to get them. That. Right. No, but Louis now, like with Virgil Abloh, right? Like, oh. The LV Supreme collab. Do you reckon they'll probably do more then, surely? North Face. Mm. Overrated, but it looks nice. Do you know what I mean by overrated? Like everyone mm, but has it's it. But become like a, like a JD brand. Like. Leave if we could, I could put it. I would put it C in between C and D. But we'll yeah. leave it in probably C. Yeah, we'll it. leave it in C because it's a bit like it's too it's too mainstream. People made it mainstream. It used to be a sick brand though. Not God, don't get me wrong. All right, should we just go? For, we're gonna go for the more feminine side here. Chanel never bought anything for them. Uh, probably for like my nan or something. But let's. I don't know. Like for for girls, that's surely like quite high in its Chanel bags, think about it. But the, and then again, it's not because that, because girls will get an LV bag in it. Mm. That'll be more premium. We're gonna put them in B, all right? Girls, anyone watching, comment down below. <laughs> Ooh, is that Off-White? No, that's blunt. I thought that's Off-White. I swear Off-White have that V, no? No. Right. How come Off-White is not in here, though? No, it is, it's Off-White. We got Off-White here. That? Where are we putting, because oh, Off-White should be here, right? Because if good, be, yeah. because they can't be. I think A is more luxury. Like you go mm. to Harrods, that's something you find at Harrods. You know, like, you get off white or yeah, you probably do, but I mean, like you know, like them premium, premium brands. I, I feel like B is the category of like Instagram models, and then A, you're like A, a star celebrity, and S, you're just some god. Uh, Levi's. I think gods are, are wearing like Air Max Murray. Levi's. <sighs> Might fit there, you know. And they make, all I say, they make good jeans. I, yeah, I would actually well, that's like, it, right? Harrison, I'm sorry. Yeah, nah, <laughs> <laughs> nah, I, I, I'm not, they're just very like, same -ish. They're very like, like if I could imagine a standard guy named John, nine to five job, <laughs> family wife and a briefcase and four children, I would say Levi's. So we, yeah, Stone Island, okay, that one. More hooligan-y, is that a word, hooligan-y? I don't know, but, but then again, they do make some nice stuff like, mm. you know what I mean? Like Dave wears a lot of, I think I'd probably put them here. Really? Or, I might put them in C. Because I oh, North Face then, isn't it? Nah, because like but, some, but people like, overuse them. They do make some nice stuff, but then like, yeah. like look at like their jumpers, like they're just plain jumpers yeah, with a thing on the side. Just, just the goggles, like I'm not. Uh, I've never been a fan of the goggles. I don't know why. Like, who's seeing at their arm? Like, no. <laughs> Stone Island. There it is. Oh, no, let's see. Oh, oh. oh right, end the video. Um, all right, guess. All right, great. I'm sure they do this. Sorry, I was about to say that's just feminine, but it's not. No, no, they do some they nice do. stuff as well. I actually had a guess oh. what watch once. Um, it's just disappeared. Oh, wait. No, it's here, it's here, it's here. It's very dim. If you got, you put your glasses on. Guess. Oh, I could have to put in B. But then, it, oh, I don't know. Yeah, but I'll put, I'll put in B, because like, not B? men, no, but for women more, not for men, but for women more, they're more expensive. Some reason, I don't know why. Or should we not? I haven't seen them. See, see, like, see. Like, like big brand. Like, like it looks like there's only white. two. Fi there's only two things there, but there's actually four. All right, Lee, use your eyes. Uh, we've got Lacoste La or Lacoste, uh, wherever you're from. Uh, the French brand, I believe. Lacoste is good. Uh, Best cream for that, uh, Christine. Okay, I say B. I said B before was Instagram model, yeah. Mm. So who Instagram model when the Lacoste? I, I, I think yeah, why it's, is I, it only for Instagram? Okay, no, 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 forget that. I think it's absurd to wear like a, a Lacoste, like, do you know the polo shirt? Back in the day, 2011, 100%, you're like a baller if you wore that. Mm. But, like now, I would say the only thing that ain't good is like shoes, like canvas shoes for certain white people. <laughs> Don't you think? I'm going to have to put them here. They're not on that, that you, you tell me yeah, Lacoste are not on that level for these lot. Yeah. Uh, Burberry. I, I love the, the only thing about them is that, as, apart from shirts and scarves, like what else do they make then? 
No, they're vegan. No, they're actually doing what I'm saying. Like, if you generalize it to that, I would say though, they're Do you definitely. Hear apparently, like, they've, like, they've burnt like their whole stuff, but they don't want to put their stuff on sale. Really? Because they don't want like normal people though. in there to buy it. Not wow, normal people. Who do they think they are? <laughs> Jeez. Uh, oh, we got some. That's Fendi. I think Fendi. Fendi is like, I think that's A class. Oh, uh, oh yeah. Okay, in terms of like luxury, where's it gone? It don't tell me it's one of the disappearing ones. Or oh, we moved it. Nah, it's, it's not there. It's, it's generally is genuinely just vanished. All right. Okay, Fendi. We're gonna say that it was A class. All right. Just pretend it's there. Um, let's go for Balenciaga. Big name. Big money, splash cash. All right. Um, oh, do we put it at? It's, it's obviously B or A, surely, yeah. yeah. But but oh nah nah. Is it on A? With it's a. not A. It's not A because They're like it's not. Shoes have yeah, 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 it's the bottom of the shoe. They are they are nice though, but it's more Instagram model as I said again. <laughs> that B should just be the Instagram model. Let's be on champion. Very good brand like nice like retro garms mm. vintage but some people are letting them down you know you know what i mean just certain people are letting them down like people that's, that's called like, being deep right. I'm, I'm contradicting myself because i'm wearing a hat here but you know the people that wear the the, the pole the ralph Lauren caps yeah the mm. front ones and they have and they wear in champion e all right we're not putting there we'll put we'll put we'll put here we'll put in c category is it is it we'll put in c category i don't know why they would make black ones on a black background Sure. Dior, let's call them like that. Where's that? Where's that? Their recent collab with Corbs. Yeah. Mm, that I've ever seen good. it. I did like that. What would you put it as in? B or C? They are proper prestige. Their stuff are expensive. Really? No, but yeah, then again, we're not basing these on prices. For example, some, yeah, of, some, Ace, of, some of Ace or stuff, if it was on there, are fire. <laughs> but like then, but then again, we are. We're not actually basing these on prices, are we? Really? Because like. Versace is more than Nike, isn't it? Mm. So we're gonna we'll, we'll put them at B because they're luck. It's about like the feel of it. So if you wear Dior, yeah, yeah, you're doing well for yourself. Let's just say, at the very least. Uh, a lot of these brands, I just, I honestly just don't know. But let's just let's just slap something I don't know. Okay. Like, I, no, we know that one. That one. That's like they make jeans, but I mean, they're not like big. Okay, big, Craig like, Green. Yeah, like we don't know what that is. All right, this. Can't even I can't even understand that ungodly language. Yeah? Brain dead. Don't know what that is. Yeah? Oh 32 C. Don't know what it is. Okay. Viet men's. How do you say that? How do you say that? Veteran. No, I say Viet men's. Yeah? Okay, veterans. Where are we putting that? Surely B. If we're if we're okay, if we're putting Balenciaga there, then that's in the same category as a bit yeah, yeah. white. You know what I mean? They're similar brands in that sense. Alexander McQueen. What do you think of them boat shoes? Oh, e. I don't like them. They look disgusting. Oh wait, do you, oh wait. Hang on. There's the debate before we put it. Givenchy or Da Vinci? Da Vinci. Da Vinci. Da Vinci. They will say because it's like it says given and then chi. It has to it has to be B, doesn't it? A lot, a lot, yeah. It's like it's more than like a Lacoste, for example. Is that it, which we can use for oh. for B, like, or do we gonna start kicking some out? We might have to, depending on what there is left. But there's not many left that we actually know. But look, if you actually look at C, they're basically look look at all of them: mm. Kenzo, Lacoste, Sunline, North Face. They're basically brands that were good and then they mm. got washed out by you know by chance, basically, and wrong ones. So like Prada, you know, we know Prada. But then, it, it, I swear, it fell off like years ago. Like, not many people wear it. A lot of people used to wear the shoes, like, like shoes, no. t-shirts. Oh yeah, yeah shoes. A lot of people used to wear belts. Yeah. I'd say it's when it fell off because it you know, cost in it, sort of thing. I say, I say it's a C list, all right? Fear of God. But wait, that where is, is that? What's his name? I don't know. I don't know. What? Jerry Lorenzo. Fear of God. He's the one that just made them. Um, we saw it yesterday that shot. I think I've got to go and see for now. Yeah, we'll go, we'll now. go, we'll go and see. He hefty C there. But then, it, oh, it's like, I, I've never heard of that brand, ever. Mm -hmm. I might have seen it. They look like Air like. Max. They actually look like Air Max. Here's a picture of them now. Fear of God look like Air Max, just saying. Conspiracy theory. Alright. Montclair. I think it was better than Air Max. Oh, that's where we have to start kicking up B list. Montclair, surely. 
Okay, I'll say this, yeah? I'm not that big of a Palace. Monkey. Surely we put Palace down one. No, I think Tommy Hilfiger should go down one. Big, big statement just, by Howard. Just oh, wait, kick them out. Oh, okay, okay. I'm quite upset about that, to be honest. But, okay. Um, oh, fuck, where was it? I hate it because you know when you move something, everything else shifts. Oh, Montclair, yeah? So Montclair's going in B. Can't really see it, but it is there. Next, we have got Commies de Garbons. The Garcons, whatever you have to say. Uh, that's the Love Heart one, right? He's yeah. getting that right, yeah. I say the Love Heart one, it's, it's, it's Commies de Garcons. They've done a Supreme collab, they've done a few collabs. Uh, where are we putting that? Did they do a super, uh, Off White one, didn't they? I don't think so. Maybe that was with someone else. We're gonna put this. I say we'll put pin, maybe C. C because we, we're, we're unsure, but we're not gonna put what we don't know what it is because we do know what it is. Uh, the one I said before I knew. Pleasures. They make good clothing, but again, I'm gonna put them at a D because it's not. I don't know. It's not something that you'd I'd always want to wear. Calvin Klein. Again, one of those things I think that mm, fell off. Fell off. Yeah. I've, I put. I didn't put D. Maybe you know, because other than boxes, I, w I wouldn't wear like. Yeah. That's true, yeah, that, other than that. Other than boxes, you know. Uh, ball main. Ah, that's difficult. Do we put it in C or do we kick one out of B? That's the big question. Mm. Like that, these are big questions that need to be answered right now. C or D. But if we look at B, right, I'm going to be controversial on this one, but does, does golf need to be there? Because how long have been there around for that long? Leave it as off white. Uh, yeah, but off white. Now, nah, but off white are still like the. It's still if you got off white, you know what I mean. You're, you're making a name for yourself. Hey, I, I personally think. Oh no, because D. Oh, no. D always big. D always big. Um, okay, we'll put ball main C, yeah. But we're we're gonna say that it, it should be between C and D, but we're gonna put it at C. Um, we just put have we got Versace. I thought that's a Jake Paul then. Have we got Versace up in A? Yeah. That, nah, nah, think about it. Versace, like, you know, if you see someone wearing Versace, like, especially the silk, like, gold and black shirts, like, game over, GG. But that, that's almost good, though, because, like, if it was, if everything was really high, then it would be like, okay, everything you wear is good. But there's only a few select things that are very. But then again, if you think about it, we before we were looking at culture, before we done these, I wouldn't say, I would say that these two are better than these two. I would say that like more what? prestigious brands are better than Nike and Adidas in that sense, but the only reason we put them at the top is because like they made a name for themselves and they've been around mm. for years. But actually, we're gonna leave them there because they're just the, the go-to. Like you can't go wrong with Nike and Adidas. Yeah. Because like they're reasonably affordable, cheap. Yeah. Some, it's a, it, it, but and also they sell stuff as expensive, mm. like special edition clothing. Okay, Ralph Lauren. Again, mm. I do think has fallen off. Yeah. Yeah. I'll probably say D. Yeah. D. Obviously, D. That is in the category. Okay, if we're putting that at D, then the cost must go down, surely, no? Or that is, it can't it can be. No, the so, well, cost is better than Ralph Lauren, I reckon, at the moment. Okay, yeah, uh, yeah uh, debatable. Alright. Okay, Philip, uh, Philip Pleen, I don't know how to say that brand, you know that brand. Philip Pleen, Fien, Fien. No. Uh, I'm getting it so wrong right now, alright, but this brand is, is hella expensive, but because. Actually, do you know what we're gonna put? I don't know what this is. No, but we do know what it is. I don't know. Well, because you don't know what it is, I'm gonna put it as that. Because something we don't know what it is means that, like, if both of us know what it is, it should go in there. But we mm. obviously both don't. And what do we hate, though? Surely we put Levi's as hate. There has to be one that's like hate. Dickies, surely. <laughs> I'm tempted. What ones have we hate? Nah, because I, I don't think there's a brand I hate, because if I hate it, I wouldn't know about them. Or like it's not that I wouldn't know. I, I wouldn't wear it if I if I hated it. You mm. know what I mean? There's not. I don't think there's a brand I hate necessarily. But Slazenger would go there, though. But Slazenger is not. Actually, should we just put this brand here? Because we're gonna put that on there. Because we can't even read what it says. Kind of, it's like in some other language. I'm trying to see now. We don't know any of these, do we? Mm. How is that a brand? So you're gonna wear that in your t-shirt? No, I've heard of them. Mason Margiela. I just. But are that. they called Mason uh, yeah, Margia or are they called 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, <laughs> well, I don't know what they're called. Alright, that's been it for our tier video on clothing brands in 2019. Obviously, some of the ones that fell off, they could be better, like i.e. the cost. Kenzo, North Face, Stone Island, they used to be good, Tommy Hilfiger, but they've gone down from certain people. Let me know in the comment section down below what you'd rate these um, and what categories you'd put them, S being the best and F. 
hate being, I can't even read that. Or if you don't know what it is, then comment that too. Thank you so much for watching. We also made another video uh, that would be in the link in the description of the 2019 rappers, but we just generalized them. So go check that video out. <laughs> Subscribe, like the video, turn on the post notifications. I'll see you guys in a bit. Run, 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 run